Hi folks, today we are going to see how to export the CS4 DAT file to Stata. Uh, for exporting a data file, first of all, we need, we, it's always better to have a separate folder to export the data. It's uh, I'm making a separate folder for a export the data, like a export, making export. Uh, now, other main point is we need a dictionary that uh, dictionary and the data file. Uh, the dictionary is what I'm exactly what uh, we vary the data entry and the data is it's concerned di dictionary we have to exactly the same dictionary we have to take if any minor changes and anything it's happened it's it, it's very difficult to export the data so I'm just getting the dictionary this is the data file this is household data file and this is the dictionary I just copied and put it in the export holder copy to paste it in the export holder uh, now I am going to the uh, CS Pro, uh, CS Pro, CS Pro, opening the CS Pro application, uh, going to the tool parts, there is the export data, okay, uh, you just click the export data and then you have to find the dictionary where we have kept the things, so I kept the things in the uh, desktop clicking the things this is the household folder and I'm just clicking the export folder yeah I got it yeah now we have to select the uh, now this is the household and the married uh, there is a two layers of the data structure uh, so we I am going to export all the um, files in a go if you want in a single go you can have a separate uh, you can have uh, unselect all those things also if I want to only export the household data only we just remove the currently married woman structure dictionary uh, level and if you want to only do it in household questionnaire then you can select like that so i am going to do or export all those things so first of all uh, there is a couple of options actually number of files to be created you can create a one file or a multiple file it's uh, if you want to have a separate reach record you can have a click the multiple files otherwise you have to go with a one file I am going to get, go with the one file single file uh, there is a output of multiple record occurrence uh, it's nothing but it's a separate you can have a separate records also it's a, uh, uh, as well as you can have a one record uh, in, in this part I am going to do it in a one record and if, uh, here the export items are both items or sub items uh, I want to export all the both items and sub items I am clicking that thing and then now I, I want to data select the data to uh, Stata so I have selected the Stata holder and then just click the run command uh, run option so it's I'm clicking the run option this is the data file I just selected and give open and this is the option will come this is the path where the data is saved and what is the export DCT and it export do file so you just click OK uh, once you will get click the OK, you will find this is the dictionary, this is the ex all the variables are exported and they just simply close the things, close everything, you can close all those things. Uh, you, you can save it and kept later on the same export, you can also do it, otherwise you can just close it. Uh, if you go to the uh, desktop folder, you will find there is a do file. So now I have what I am going to do is open a, for a, opening a data file. I am going to open uh, get the Strata. Strata. Uh, yeah, this is the Strata, and then go to File. Um, open a do file. I'm just going to open a do file. Uh, go to Desktop. This is the export holder. Click the do export add, and just yes, this is the things. So this is the things and you can have uh, once it will automatically executed and you can find the things in the data file, data editor or a data browser. If, if you are clicking that variable manager also you can see it and this is the variable managers and uh, if you want to see the data file you just see that this is the data files it's clearly exported and you can save the data file yeah like a household data. Also, also, just I put a dot DTA and it's a save. So the data file is saved. Uh, this is the way. Hope you it helps you to how to do this thing. If you like the video, if.
if you like the video give me a likes and if you have any comments please give me comments on the bottom uh, you can subscribe the video subscribe that my channel also thanks for watching have a nice day